What's up people, Tesseran here, welcome back to the world of Warcraft and we are continuing on with Legion because it's awesome. Uh, so at the moment, uh, or rather last night, I carried on doing uh, my leather working and skinning and stuff like that and I've actually topped um, my skinning already, it's at 800 and that was purely just to gather the mats required just to kick off. Uh, the leather working and get some recipes going. Also did a bit of uh, the storyline with Cadgar. We had to go to somewhere in Surumur. I don't know. Um, investigated a crash site. Found a giant. Took something. And we need to work out what this mysterious glowy thingy is. Which is why we are here speaking to uh, the prophet. Uh, so we're at the Exodar, and this place is getting invaded. Yeah. So this is uh, continuing on with the scenario. I'm laying down the bush. I just want to say this is why this is why people have their ground clutter turned off for PvP because I think it's I think you shouldn't be able to. I think you should stay like this, and therefore it's not only ropes that can sneak around. But I am there, look. But you just cannot see me. Anyway. Let's crack on. Let's crack on. So, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm assuming I just need to shoot some shit. Snippy's getting a little bit confused there as to where he needs to go. Dead. Lovely. And you probably also noticed by now is that I am rocking a new add-on well not new, it's one that I used to use but then just never updated and just forgot about it but it's the Titan panel which I'm going to reset because obviously this has been sat here for a while but it gives us an idea of how long it will be to level also got gold, location and bags up there just for shits and giggles really I mainly only use it for the uh, the XP calculator but it's constantly changing constantly updating if you're interested in it it's just called Titan panel and there's loads of plugins that you can turn off and switch on and add to it uh, you can get performance put on there, um, loot types, blah blah blah. Okay, so go and buy that one kill for as long as we've been playing. It's going to take three points, and it's rising days. It is no coincidence that no Jaden sent an Eredar to slaughter my people. The deceiver revels in his creative punishments for those that dare defy him. They're coming for me, kill. Get out the shit, get out the shit. if he's not helping too much at the moment I'm getting loads of aggro shit more coming still got another 30 odd seconds before I could use my acceleration again Have I got any traits that actually reset the cooldown of that then? Getting my ass kicked. Ah! 
And another one's coming. Oh no! I'm an honest guy, so I'm not going to edit that out, but... In the vault of lights. be easier just to take the back door, wouldn't it? I wonder if I'm able. Oh, invisible wall bullshit! No, we're not able to take the back door. I didn't think we would be as it's a scenario, but it was certainly worth a try. Might as well get snippy back. Okay, clearly that's where we need to go. Did you see that? Is it safe for us, do you think? Yes! Fate has delivered you to us in this most dire time, hero. While I sense that your mission is urgent, if we do not push back these invading demons, we will all perish. This barrier protecting my people requires all of my energy and focus. I am afraid you must venture into the demon-infested halls alone. Please, search for survivors and eliminate the Legion invasion point portals that you find across the Exodar. You must hurry. I do not know how much longer I can keep this barrier active. Break your bodies upon the Prophet's barrier, minions. Soon it shall fall, and with it, the hopes of the Draenei. Your will be done, Master. Your interference only delays the inevitable. Minions, destroy them! We've got a couple of rare spotted, so... How do I get to that other side? Well, there's one there, let's go deal with that one. Try and stay out of the way of everything as much as possible because once one starts, that's it, they're all going to slap you, aren't they? We've got loads of rares coming up. You son of a. Literally hit him. Oh, we ain't got snipping in here. hill came from. I'm not complaining though. But get in here. Just the hand of Argus. Right. So 
So we still need five more foul portals. Oh, they're survivors. So I'm going to leave those to it. Ooh. Sorry, I wasn't able to sidestep right there. I do it facing that way, I don't want to pull too many. Should be enough to deal with that one. Bloody child. Get out of here, fool. I don't think this is going to be a quick scenario. dealing with that I'm gonna shut this portal down before any more come through. I know the experience Titan thing saying we're gonna level up in five days. It's not, it's just these things are giving us just the bare minimum experience points. Plenty of rare spotted though, so I'm hoping that they're going to be actual rare elites. Silver dragon, nice bit of loot. Suit me to a T, that would. So that one that looks like we've missed, that's actually a level below. So I'm not too fussed about that. It is level 104. I think we'd be able to take it if it wasn't for this complete I mean if I could get these to join in 
That would be bloody something. Well, that wasn't me that pinged the mini map. Whoa. So, unless there's another player here, I wouldn't have thought so, though. It's a scenario. I think I'm pretty much on my own. Oh damn, what the hell are these things? Not bothered though, we apparently we're getting healing. So sod it. Let him rip boy. That went pretty much exactly according to plan. So let's clear those ones. Shit. Oh well, if we do it up here at least we'll have help and healing. What the hell was that? We completed a quest there that I didn't know we had.
Right, before we head up, apparently there's two here. I can't see them, but apparently they're on this level. There's one. Has to be bloody kids. Ah, oh, there's another one. Okay, so we'll head up. When we killed this one. God me, I wasn't expecting the scenario to be Oh shit. That should give us help. But I still need what, five more citizens. Like to use disengage to stop any uh, damage from falling. Perhaps that one's inside the bank or auction house or whichever building that is there. Okay, can't see any more on the minimap yet, so that's no help. Can I continue to close these down anyway? No, I can't. Okay, so anywhere where there is a portal still that I can't close is a dangerous place to be. Traffic. That looks like there's a quest there. Mm. Oh, there's a big bitch in here, big bitch. Big bitch alert. The collapse shaft on the northern edge of the crystal hall. We are holding back the demon onslaught. But our defenses are quickly falling apart. I need one more. What would be the easiest one to get to? It's going to be one in there, isn't it? They must respawn because this is the Bolt of Lights. We started in here. Yay! The champion has crushed the incursion. Now is the time to take the Chosen and finish off the leftover demonic taint within our halls. Secure the Exoda for our people once more. As you command, Prophet. <laughs> I 
I fear we have but a moment, hero. Rakish is still here, somewhere, and he must be stopped if my people are to find peace again. I know that you have ventured far to find me, and have brought with you a dire message. In your possession is an object of great importance. May I see it? This is the thing we found. Will you join our cause? Mother of Light! That thing. I... I'm sorry. I... I did not know. Champion, we have to go. Now! I will explain on the way there. Inform me when you are prepared to leave. But please, hurry. We must unite against... I'm ready. What you have brought to me is known as Light's Heart. It is the sentient's core of the Naru Prime, Zira, locked away within the core. His wisdom, knowledge, crucial to our battle against the Burning Legion. Yet only a Naru born of Zira is capable of unlocking the core. This is why you were sent here. This is the true purpose of the Burning Legion's invasion of the Exodar. The last of Zira's line. Oros sits unguarded in the heart of the Exodar. If they destroy Oros, the information within Light's heart will be lost forever. For a prophet, you are doing a very poor job of making predictions. <laughs> it makes music when you beat it. What a delightful creature. I will enjoy ending its existence. Light, damn him! I will guide us to the heart of the vessel. Stay within my protective barrier as I cleanse the fell taint from the pathway. Simple enough. A cleaning spell. Sort of thing I'll need when I want to go into my kid's bedroom. We have made it in time. By the grace and glory of the light, I will heal Oros. Then we will deal with Rakish. You have lost Rakish. Oros is renewed, and now you must answer That's an awful lot of fell over it. You have committed. Ah, the fated heroes have arrived. It would appear that you have bested me, Velen. But before I surrender and face the judgment of the light, there is one last thing I must do. What the shit? Can you know victory without first knowing defeat? Come, fail, die. When well, he's clearly a dick, but I do like the Draenei with the red skin. I think it looks cool. Okay, defeat High General Rakish. Well, I don't know where he's gone. Let's have a quiet word with that instead then. Oh shit. I am here now to prepare a place for you amidst the ruin of tomorrow.
Oh, excellent. We are getting healing. Because we need it. What exactly is the point of the pets? I mean, I know we're not to rely on the pet as much because we're now marksmanship, but wow, do something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You asked me hey. if I foresaw this day, child. He took some shit, didn't he? I... I did. And until this moment, I did not understand. In the time that is now just the whisper of a memory, I had a son. On the day of his birth, a vision came to me. In that vision, I saw myself weeping as I held a dying Eredar in my arms. His skin fell pocked and battle scarred, like yours. But I buried that vision after Kil Jaden took my family from me, and for eons that it be lost in the darkest recesses of my being. Now, finally, as I hold you in my arms, I understand. There is nothing left here for you, champion. Take Light's heart and return to Khadgar. Tell him... Tell him that the Light died here this day. Farewell. He teleports the caster back to Dalaran, so that is... That's what we'll do. Right, so we got a trinket. Um, it's what we got from the rare. Huntmaster's Injector. And it gives us 377 versatility, which, to be honest, I couldn't give us jolly smoke about just couldn't care less however your spells and abilities have a chance to increase your critical strike haste or mastery by 755 for 10 seconds whichever is highest and I believe for us that would be crit no mastery so that will increase our range and damage of all focus spending abilities. So I'm going to definitely use that. 705, it's going to be instead of the 700, obviously, giving us now an item level of 711. Uh, since the last uh, video, I have gained some other stuff. I haven't transmogged it all in that, purely because I, well, I did do the helmet. Because you saw the new helmet and it looked like dog shit. 
So I change that pronto. But we'll go through all that uh, another time. Gul'dan and the Legion must be stopped. Okay, so we've got. Well, that's a shame. They're both 723. Both awesome. They're both better than what we've got. Uh, looks the same, but a different colour, so I'm not fussed about that. However, that will give us an item level of 723 from 705, and that will give us 723 from 699, so it will give us the best overall average. So I'm going to go for the wrists. Although not as much, and it doesn't give us as much as what shoulders would it give us the highest increase in base you are our last best hope. item level so that's what I'm using right and that's it that's all I need to do for this dude place the lights heart in your order hall so we need to go back there Okay. And that's quite a trek, isn't it? Because our order fall is in the high field stuff, so just so I don't have to bore you with the long journey I'm gonna I'm gonna call it there and we'll pick this up uh, in the next one at the thing yeah you'll love it so thanks an awful lot for watching I really appreciate it Um, if you could do me the honor of uh, hitting that like button and leaving me comments and all the rest of it I would very much appreciate it and if you haven't already done so please subscribe for regular uploads Thanks again, and I'll see you all soon.